Taylor Sheridan, the guy behind Yellowstone, is a man on a quest to explore new horizons of the Yellowstone Ranch. The brilliant television producer has created an empire around romantic drama, tough guys and cowboys, producing TV's most tremendous success in years and wildly successful spin-offs. The prequels 1883, which appeared in 2021, and 1923, which aired on December 18th, are well known to franchise fans. We heard Yellowstone 6666 so much so that we thought it would be a major part of the Yellowstone 2023 series, but it turns out that the creator has has begun work on the new Yellowstone spin-off series called 6666. The show will focus on the lives of cowboys who work and reside at the 6666 ranch in Texas. We can pronounce it as for sixes, as in we heard about in Yellowstone 2. We, the fans of Yellowstone, have already seen this farm. This farm was initially featured in Season 4 when underperforming ranchman Jimmy was brought there to try and sort himself out. It was mentioned again in Season 5, Episode 7, when John Dutton thought about sending his farm animals there for the winter, and Beth was motivated to begin selling beef under the Yellowstone brand after visiting the 4 Sixes successful website. But to our greatest surprise, that was some skillfully done in-show promotion for an internationally best-selling business that the Sheridan Co. owns, wasn't it? So, we've gathered all the information about 4 Sixes. Keep watching as we're gonna share everything. Hey, before we do this together, subscribe and press the bell icon. Why this name? The property was allegedly won by Samuel Burnett in a game of cards with 4 Sixes. His heirs dispute that, claiming that the ranch's word actually derives from the reality that Burnett stamped 4 Six on the back of his first herd of cattle. Instead of saying 6666 or 6666, you say 4 Sixes. You might be pleasantly surprised that it took Sheridan so long to realize 4 Sixes' storytelling promise after learning about its historical reality. After the ranch's former owner tragically died in 2020, Sheridan bought the 4 Sixes ranch in May 2021. This was the ranch's only sale in more than 150 years. It covers three counties and more than 450,000 acres in Texas and was founded by the rancher and oilman Samuel Burnett in 1900. Burnett went away in 1922 and his great-granddaughter and win for Marion received the property after him. What would the Yellowstone 46 be released? Till now, the release dates have not been released. A profile on Taylor Sheridan decided to offer some optimism for fans, wanting to see more of her Texas ranch in November, ahead of Yellowstone Season 5 release. The show is scheduled to launch sometime in 2023, according to The Atlantic, which doesn't give into depth about the show's destiny. Nonetheless, the most recent episode of Yellowstone made more hints. What would the show Yellowstone 46s be aired? 46s will broadcast on Paramount Network alongside Yellowstone, but the other spin offs, 1883, 1923, and 1883 The Base Reef Story, are only available on Paramount Plus. Yellowstone's past seasons may be watched online on Peacock, Peacock, but 4 Sixes will probably be accessible to watch on Paramount Plus after it began airing on Paramount Network. What would be the storyline of 4 Sixes? In a press release, Paramount Plus stated that the show would examine the illustrious 4 Sixes ranch's past. Read the complete synopsis that was provided when the show was first announced below. No ranch in America is more immersed in the heritage of the West than 4 Six, which was established while Comanche still ruled over West Texas. The Four Sixes, which still runs precisely as it did two centuries ago and spans an entire province, is a location where the natural laws and the law of the land collide, and where the following thing one does is usually the most risky. The Four Sixes represents the relentless quest to produce the world's best heroes and cattle and is eventually the place where world-class cowboys are created. Sheridan, John Linson, Art Linson, David Glasser, Ron Burkle, and Bobby Airy will serve as the series' executive producers. Who would we see in the Yellowstone Four Sixes? Although the cast hasn't been confirmed, Jimmy was taken to the Four Sixes in Season 4 of Yellowstone to get in shape. He chose to stay rather than the return of the Yellowstone Ranch since he had fallen in love with the location. While Catherine Kelly, who performs Emily, Jimmy's girlfriend whom he met at the Four Sixes, will nevertheless be returning to Yellowstone as major characters. Maybe that indicates they'll remain to do so throughout Yellowstone Season 5 as the foundation for the future show. Another possibility is that Rip, Cole Hauser, and Beth would travel to the Four Sixes as hinted at in Season 5 Episode 7 when John asked Rip to lead the relocation of the Yellowstone's cattle to a region with a moderate winter and Beth agreed to go with him. In the end, Rip and Beth probably won't be leaving Yellowstone, but the main show is preparing something for the Four Sixes. So, it's left to be seen who would enter Yellowstone for Four Sixes and what would become of the show. If there's any news available about the Yellowstone Four Sixes, we will keep you posted here. To stay updated, subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon. Also, like and share our videos.